Beads. That's right. Cool. Hi, everybody. Hi. Um, so we're going to be talking a little bit about the uh, Chicago Tribune Election Center tonight. Um, thank you to Derek, Chris, and everybody who organizes this event. It's good to see some new faces. Good to see old faces. Casey, did you ever come in and uh, video yeah. preview? Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah. <laughs> Um, cool. So, uh, so let me just give a couple of announcements, or just a little bit about myself. So, I'm the news applications developer for the Chicago Tribune. You can read our blog at apps.chicagotribune.com. Um, I also helped start an organization called Free Geek Chicago. You can learn about that at freegeekchicago.org. If you have old computer equipment, please bring it in. We are open Wednesday through Sunday from 11 to 5 at 3411 West University. Um, volunteers will come in, take apart the equipment that you donate, uh, uh, cut the parts, put it back together, and at the end of 24 hours, they get a free computer. Um, we also sell desktop systems starting at $40, desktop systems starting at $60. We take no grant or foundation funded for political reasons and we're community government. Um, so come check it out. Uh, also, uh, I run a group on Saturdays at that same space, 3411 West University, uh, 3 in Chicago, called the Supreme Shy Hand Coding Group. Um, and that was actually the group that made the Crime and Punishment site that you just saw. It's a really funky, diverse group of people who learn fundamental web skills. Uh, and you don't need any knowledge to come and hang out with us. We learn fundamental web skills by doing data journalism. So right now our big project is scraping data about your canning jail that nobody has. We need people to come and help us visualize it um, and analyze it. So we can check that out as well. 